Hey, what's going on guys, Shad here. So are you not able to install the extensions for your Adobe applications because your ZXP installer is showing that the extension is not compatible with the applications you are using, even if you are using the compatible one. Just don't worry, in this video I will be going to show you the two different methods using which you can install your extension for your Adobe application very easily. Just watch the video till the end and without wasting any further time, let's get started. I know guys, the extensions are very important for us because it makes our lot of work easier. And it is also very frustrating because it is not getting installed. So guys, we have two different methods using which we can install our extension for Adobe applications. First one is using the ZXP installer and second one is manual. So guys, first of all, let's start with the ZXP installer method. So guys, now I'm going to show you an extension that I have. So this is the Motion Pro and now I'm going to try to install it using the ZXP installer. So I am dropping it here. Now I am getting this error message. I am getting one more error message which I will show you in a second. So this is the second error message. So now let's close this. And now come back and you will have to download this application. The download link of this is given in the description box and it is completely free. Then you will have to install it. I have already installed. So I am now opening it. After opening this application, you will have to go to the extension folder and now you will have to drop it here. Then click on install. As you can see, it is installed successfully. Click on OK and you can see the here Motion Pro is written. Now you can close this. Now I am going to open the Premiere Pro to show you that extension is installed or not. I am using Premiere Pro 2020. Now I am going to Windows, then Extension and here you can see the Motion Pro is installed and it is working also. So guys if you don't want to use the ZXP installer and you want to install the extensions manually, you can try this method. So guys, in this manual method, first we have to uninstall the extension that we had installed in the previous method. So I am uninstalling that extension. Now I am uninstalling the Motion Pro. I am uninstalling it from the After Effects and it will automatically get uninstalled from the Premiere Pro 2. So as you can see that nothing is here. So let's close this. And now I have this extension. So you will have to right click on this, click on rename. Now you will have to change its extension which is from ZXP to ZIP zip file and click on yes. Now we have to extract this zip file using the WinRAR. Now you have to copy the extracted folder. And you have to go to the C drive, then program x86, then common files, then adobe, then you will have to find the CEP folder and open it, then extension and here you will have to paste that folder that you have copied. Just click on continue. So now our extension is successfully installed. I am showing you by opening the Premiere Pro. I am using the 2020 version. So I am going to Windows, then extension and here you can see the Motion Pro. Now I am selecting the folder where I have installed or extracted the file. So after selecting this, your extension will work successfully. As you can see that it is working completely. 
So guys, that's it for this video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please hit the like button. And if you have any thoughts or what video or any topic, feel free to comment down below and subscribe to our channel for more amazing videos like this. I will catch you in the next one. Till then, peace.